Hello. In this demonstration, we will show the variation in the impedance and reflection coefficient as we go across different points along the transmission line and the trace of this variation on the Smith chart. Our setup consists of three components. First, we have a vector network analyzer, which serves as the signal source and the Smith chart display. Next, we have an adjustable coaxial transmission line with an air core. And finally, we have a resistive load impedance, which is connected to the other end of the transmission line. Now we have a close-up view on the Smith chart display. The resistive load impedance appears on the negative real axis, which indicates that the value of the resistance is less than Z0, which is 50 ohms in this case. Now, I will increase the length of the transmission line and see what happens to the marker on the Smith chart. Now I will retract the length of the transmission line back to where it was originally.